Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. If you're not subscribed yet, you're missing out. 2020 is like the party asshole that suggested tequila shots and then went home 30 minutes later. Now you're drunk, disoriented, and alone and have to settle a bill for a round of shots you never wanted. 20 plenty, more like 20 alone and poor. But there are some solid lessons 2020 is teaching us. Some because the world has been forced to slow down and we finally have some extra time. Some are just plain funny. We took a look at some of the skills 2020 has forced us to learn, and we're sure some will make you laugh while others will help you up your game. Number 1. How to Prevent Bushfires Australia has experienced some of the worst wildfires in recent memory, but California, the Mediterranean, India, Poland, England, even the Arctic have had massive fires. 2020 gifted us with a stark reality that the climate is changing and we might not be as prepared as we need to be. The biggest thing to prevent the increasing number of bushfires is to stop global warming, but failing that, the second thing we can think of is to prevent bushfires from starting altogether. Here are some tips that the Victorian government in Australia put forward to help curb runaway fires. In urban areas, you should regularly mow and rake up leaves and grass. Use mulch in garden beds and keep the ground moist or non-flammable ground cover like pebbles. Remove weeds and prune bushes and trees. Store flammable materials like rubbish or wood piles away from your home. In case a fire breaks out, it's good to always have a personal protection kit on hand with goggles, gloves, a hat, long sleeve shirt, and long cotton trousers. Make sure you have a working fire hydrant in your neighborhood and that fire trucks can access it. Check that your hose can reach all areas of your garden in case a fire breaks out so you can stop it while it's only small. There's no denying the world is heating up, so best to be prepared. Number 2. How Viruses Work Tis the season to finally dive into some knowledge on viruses, it seems. How they spread, mutate, and conquer. If COVID-19 isn't enough motivation to read up on these masters of mayhem, I don't know what is. While you're at it, why not tackle bacteria? A solid understanding of how good and bad bacteria works, how much of our bodies are made up of bacteria, and how antibiotics work will help you protect your health. Then there's the newer science of phage therapy and how it might be the solution to superbugs. It's fascinating stuff, and one of the best ways to get phage fit is by gardening. Number 3. How to Up Your Immune System While on the topic of our health, few people really know how the immune system works. You might think that by throwing a bunch of vitamin C at the problem will help, but the truth is that's only one small part of it. Gut health, blood health, and a whole bunch of other systems come together to promote good health overall. Getting on top of stress is not just to help you lose weight or lower your blood pressure. Constant inflammatory conditions caused by stress can lead to chronic health problems. When you're in a constant fight or flight mode, your body is only prioritizing blood to the basic organs and not your whole system and your immune system is put on the back burner. So when you live in this state, you can't fight infection effectively. It's worth learning about so you can adjust your life and enjoy a long and healthy one. Number 4. How to Live More Simply With What You Have One of the traits of billionaires is knowing when to spend and when to save, so this one will ring true for Aluxers. During these uncertain times, it's never been better to keep your capital safe. Saving your cash is really the only security you have as markets tank all around us. 2020 is challenging us to live within our means, to bunker down and to make do. This might not be the year of upgrades, but rather the year of repairing. It's also a great exercise in simple living, in taking time to appreciate what we have, perhaps even downsize our lives. It's the time to look at what we waste our money on and how we can cut down and save more. Being limited by lockdowns has moved many people to cook at home and enjoy slow family time over endless activities. Whether we like it or not, 2020 is allowing us to stop and smell the roses and appreciate what's really important in life, and for the most part, those things are free. Number 5. How to Up Your Employment Chances 2020 is the year to remain in your job if you can. But if you're one of the unfortunate among us that suffered a job loss or your industry is taking a knock, then it might be time to up your employability game with some new skills. Spend some time getting your resume up to date and ask a friend to sub-edit it for you. Don't worry if you didn't go to an Ivy League university. Micro-credentials are becoming really important when it comes to boosting your employability, so be sure to check out our video to see what they're all about. 
There are so many courses being offered online for free at the moment, and even in non-COVID times, there have always been plenty of ways to better your skills, and you know we made a video all about it. Number 6. How to Bake Bread If you haven't already caught the wave, it'll be coming to an algorithm near you soon, but 2020's lockdown seems to be all about cooking up a storm in the kitchen. The world lost their minds in early stages of lockdown 2020, when all of a sudden we realized we can bake bread at home, like cultivating your own yeast and everything. Once we got used to that idea, it was whipped coffee, aka Dalgona coffee. If you don't know what I'm talking about, a simple Google search and your mind will be blown. Then it's time to find something to do. Probably one of the most underrated playthings is the lowly pack of playing cards. These 52 cards have endless possibilities, plus they're small, lightweight, and cheap, which is also great when you're finally allowed to travel again, you'll have some great games up your sleeve. And Aluxers stick around until the end for the ultimate in entertaining around your home. Number 7. How to Change Your Background in Zoom Who knew that one of the must-have skills in 2020 would be the ability to change your background in a Zoom meeting? Given that the bookshelf has become the must-have home decor item of the year, there's nothing that would be more satisfying than putting a grand library behind you like the one from Harry Potter, just to one-up your boss. Or you could give yourself a fake tan and put yourself on an island beach somewhere and be the envy of the office. Regardless of how you choose to use it, it's a skill worth having. Number 8. Get up to speed with the history of black rights movements Even though we hope all Aluxers are on the right side of history when it comes to equality, there's never been a better time to deep dive into the history of marginalized groups. Knowing the long history of oppression and slavery or some of the leaders in our first civil rights movements will give you the insight you need to offer support where it's needed. Acknowledging what people of color have gone through around the globe and how different groups have benefited from oppression will open your mind to ways to solve the problem and unite the world. Once you have this knowledge, we hope you'll use it to create peace and unity that allows a space for everyone. Number 9. How to Hack a Face Mask this is the year to pull a cat out of the bag, and by cat, we mean face mask, and by bag, we literally mean anything. In short, 2020's must-have skill is how to hack a face mask from any household item. The things people can make masks from is quite astounding. The amount of human resourcefulness and immediate response to the need of billions of face masks shows just how capable we are to make a plan. Next on the bill was the need for hand sanitizer, and once again the whole world rose to the challenge. From the foot pedal hand soap dispenser to home distilled surgical alcohol, the plans and recipes kept being uploaded and shared online. It's been like a massive global makerspace with the end goal of getting through COVID-19 together. Number 10. Learn How Cryptocurrency Actually Works now that the hubbub of the Bitcoin bubble burst has died down, it's time to dust off your fear and learn how it really works. We're not telling you to put all your eggs in the crypto basket, but it's a growing currency we should all understand as future billionaires. If you're a little lost, don't worry, we got you covered. We made a video all about how it works. Number 11. How to do it yourself Lockdown in many countries closed hair salons, restricted liquor sales, even closed hardware stores. There were breaks in the supply chain and many countries fresh fruit and vegetables weren't available. But all of this inspired some real urgency learning. Google fired up the search engine to answer questions like how to cut your own hair, brew your own booze, and what veggies to grow in a window box. The results of the home haircuts were pretty hilarious, but a lot can be said for being more self-sufficient and resourceful. And 2020 has certainly ushered in a new era of do-it-yourself. And speaking of coming together, stick around for the bonus for some legit essential skills. Number 12. How to let go and go with the flow 2020 has been like a roller coaster you can't get off of, and we're only halfway through. There has never been a better time to reach in deep and learn the subtle art of inner peace. Accepting what is and what is to come might be the most important skill you master this year. And while we're at it, all this staying home and postponing life events has taught us a whole lot about patience, whether we like it or not. Number 13. How to Live Greener Having been forced to slow down and spend some more time at home is a great opportunity to do a little stock take on our consumption and disposal patterns. 
Now that we aren't grabbing a daily takeout coffee or eating as many drive through meals, we are naturally reducing the amount of garbage we create. Hopefully these habits will stick with us into the future, and we can create a greener, new normal going forward. At home, this might be the time to finally figure out how you're going to separate your recycling waste. Look up some local collection points and even sort out some Tupperware to use to pack work lunches when you go back. Given that our social lives have slowed down and most of us are preparing all of our meals at home, you can finally try some packaged free shopping or take your own reusable coffee cup when you go grab a cup of joe. All in all, these are great habits to learn and add into your life. Habits the planet will thank you for. Number 14. How to Homeschool Your Children Schools being closed has added a whole new dimension to parenting. Not only are you a caregiver 24-7, but now add in teacher to that title. Sure, we know parents should always be teaching their kids as they go, but how to tie your shoes is very different from explaining long division to a 10-year-old, especially with new math. What's new math anyway? Teachers go to university for four years to learn these skills. Search engines have been blazing with desperate questions from parents on what is a mixed participle to what is the life cycle of an earthworm. In 2015, we debated the blue dress gold dress saga. 2020, we need to know who invaded who in all of the world wars. Number 15. How to solve a murder if nothing else, 2020 brought out the super sleuth in all of us. The Joe Exotic Carol Baskin saga had us all riveted for a good few days, but it's the extracurricular aftermath that really had us learning some new skills. True crimers have long been enlisting themselves to solve cold cases as they mull over evidence in chat rooms. But Tiger King made it mainstream. Everyone had their opinion on whether Carol fed Don Lewis to her cats and kittens. Videos showing how fine a meat grinder can grind bones or whether the DNA evidence could be recovered from tiger poop helped to build the theories. It seems that forensic scientists and anthropologists popped out of every corner of the internet. How to solve a murder is currently one of the must-have skills of 2020. Well, Alexers, which of these do you think is the most important thing to learn this year? And what's something that 2020 has forced you to learn yourself? Let us know in the comments. And of course, for sticking with us until the end, we have your bonus. Until now, most of us have had a lifetime avoiding eye contact with our neighbors, exchanging nothing more than a solitary grunt or half-assed attempt to hold the elevator. 2020 has presented us a unique challenge as we are confined to our homes more, and social distancing from friends and family is recommended. Now, your neighbors are the closest thing to human contact any of us have. It's time to master the skill of how to talk to your neighbors. And for this, might we suggest a few key pointers. Start off slow. You wouldn't want to scare them away. Don't corner them. Make sure they have a clear sight of an escape route and definitely don't go into their flat unless you know they don't keep big cats. Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxers. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpicked these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question on our website, alux.com. Thank you for being an Aluxer, and we'll see you back tomorrow.